Hello, it's Miss Julie from Miss Julie's Virtual Preschool and Crafts, and I'm here to celebrate a fun day on the calendar with you. It is July 21st, and we have a super fun day to celebrate, but before we get started, hit that subscribe button below so you can see when I go live and when I put out new videos just for you. All right, today's fun day on the calendar is National Hot Dog Day. That's right. Raise your hand if you enjoy a hot dog every now and then. Oh, that's great. So for today, I'm gonna to tell you a few facts about the hot dog, why we celebrate it, and then we'll make a fun craft together. All right. So we have had hot dogs around for a long time. Um, the hot dog was named after a type of dog breed called the Dash Hound. Dash Hound dog is a long, skinny type of dog, little, and they don't get too big, but the shape of the dog is a cylinder shape, long, and um, people thought those were a cute little dog, so they decided to name the hot dog after the Dash Hound dog. So, Charles Feltman in 1870 was the first man to sell hot dogs in a stand in Coney Island, Coney Island, New York. So Coney Island, and um, they were sausages, the Dutch Hound sausages, but he changed it to the name of hot dog. All right, and then that first year that he sold those hot dogs on Coney Island, he sold 3,600 hot dogs. Wow, not too bad for his first year selling hot dogs. Um, hot dogs have been around and you can find them in your local restaurants. Some people have specific stands like the man Charles Feltman, sell only hot dogs and potato chips or hot dogs and fries. Um, you can boil hot dogs cook them in a, a grill. You can microwave them, you can roast them. Sometimes they have those machines where they have the hot dogs spinning around. It's a slow roast cooker. Some people even could cook hot dogs in their slow cooker, in their uh, crock pot. You can pull, pot, get them all in there and cook a bunch of them for a party. So if you are gonna cook up some hot dogs today, you can try one of those methods or you can hit up your local hot dog stand for your favorite hot dog. Now, different areas of the country serve hot dogs differently. Where I'm from, we have Chicago hot dogs, and Chicago hot dogs are served with onion, relish, tomato, pickles, sport peppers, mustard, but no ketchup. So if you're in Chicago and you want a Chicago hot dog, do not put ketchup on it. That's not how we have it here in Chicago. Um, and in other places, they're famous for their chili cheese dogs with chili and cheddar cheese on it and onions. Some people like it with um, salsa on their hot dogs. There are many different styles and you might want to try out a tradition, a hot dog from the area if you visit. So, don't be ashamed of how you eat your hot dog. We all can eat them differently and it all tastes great. But maybe you should try out a different way to eat your hot dog today. If you never eat mustard on your hot dog, give it a try. It's awesome. All right, so for our craft today, we did not find a coloring page, but there are some out there. You just want to color too with crayons or markers. But I have a craft. So what you would need for craft is a black marker. I have a piece of brown construction paper. And then you're gonna need red and yellow paint. And to make it even more fun, a squeeze bottle. All right, now, first step I did was I drew a hot dog in a bun. There you go. Hot dog in a bun on my brown piece of paper. Okay. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna use a squeeze bottle to squirt on our ketchup and mustard. So I will put my paper down and you can see. So 
So I put my red in my squeeze bottle. If I had two squeeze bottles, I can do my yellow too. I'll just use my regular yellow bottle to squeeze them on my thing. So this will be fun. Square it on like you put in your, ooh, it's made a noise. Ooh, you can do a line of ketchup on yours. That looks like good and tasty. Now, if you like mustard like I do and the way that the Chicago dogs are made, definitely have to put mustard on yours. I guess you could do green if you had green paint. Do you pickle relish on yours? I enjoy mustard on my hot dog. So I'm gonna put some. Ooh, this is gonna be good and messy. We'll definitely need a hot dog a napkin after that. All right, so that's as simple as that. You can write um, hot dog day, July 21st, 2021 on here. Let's see, let's write national hot dog day. July inserts. Yeah. National Hot Dog Day, July 21st. All right, friends, that was exciting. And I hope you celebrate today's fun day on the calendar at home. Or you can go out and get yourself a hot dog at your hot dog stand. Come back tomorrow for another fun day with Miss Julie from Miss Julie's Virtual Preschool and crafts.